Hey everyone, so the Xperia Z3 Plus I have is actually the dual SIM card variant. Now when I bought this phone, I wasn't looking for a dual SIM phone. Uh, I only got this because I couldn't find a single SIM version. Like, it wasn't available at launch. But um, I figured why not, I might have used for the second SIM card slot at some point. Now um, this phone has two big differences between this and the regular Z3 Plus single card variant. Of course one of those being that with the dual version, you can have two SIM card slots, or you have two SIM card slots, so you can use two SIM cards at the same time. Um, this is not something that I've tested out yet, but I will try doing it soon. I'll try doing a video specifically about that. I haven't ever used dual SIM card phones, so I'm not exactly sure what to expect, like what type of things to look for. But if any of you guys have questions particularly related to the SIM card aspect of it, you let me know and I'll try to figure out. Um, try to figure that out and answer it in the video. Now the other big thing, the other big difference is this the dual SIM card variant does not support Quick Charge 2.0. So if you have that charger, it will not work with this phone. Or rather, it will work, but you won't get the uh, Quick Charge aspect of it. Now I have seen some people online who've tried using the, that charger with this phone. Uh, some of them got moderate, uh, moderately better results than just using the standard wall adapter. Some people had exactly the same results but you're not going to get like the full effect of it. So that's definitely something to keep in mind. Like if you're not interested in the uh, dual SIM card, if you don't think you're going to use a dual SIM card, then I definitely suggest getting the single SIM card variant. So um, yeah, I'm going to try doing that video. Uh, you guys can let me know what you want to see and thanks for watching.